Well, there have been high expectations on the Bath Boys golf team all season, with all but one golfer returning from last year's state qualifying team. Wildcats have lived up to the hype, winning all nine of their WBL dual meets. Today, Doug Davis's team looking to add the WBL tournament title to that resume. So we're teeing it up this morning from Will Bend Country Club in Van Wert. Carter Bowman of St. Mary's hitting his second on the par four first, and check out this shot, sticks it to about six feet. Fantastic approach. He would par the hole, finish with a 71. How about bats? Evan Hall putting for birdie on the first. Senior runs it up close. It just scoots right of the hole. Easy tap in for par. 76 on the day for Hall. Shawnee Ian Hastings also putting for birdie. The entire group was on in regulation this one. He would tap in that for par. How about Kenton's Britton Hensel? His birdie attempt, that's true, in the bottom of the cup. Finish with a 69, the medalist of the tournament. Chipped in four times during his round. Amazing round for Hensel. How about Wapak's Drew Wayman putting for birdie on the first? Little short, but a gimme par. Wayman shot a 73 today. And Brandon Hernandez of Van Wert finishing out his hole with a nice putt there. How about David Jenkins from Salina? Downhill putt, good speed, just misses. Taps in there, no problem. And check out this out for Colin Burke of St. Mary's. Out of the trap to within a couple of feet. Great shot, taps in for par. And OG's Eric Paris putting for par. That putt is true. Great action all morning long. To the team results, it is Kenton who comes out on top, defeating Bath, St. Mary's, Wapak, and Defiance, rounding out the top five.